I'm Jackie Kostek and right now on your 13 action news update, turning the tables on armed home invaders. A homeowner opens fire and sends two suspects to the hospital. This happened yesterday morning near Fort Apache and Spring Mountain. Detectives say the homeowner shot back at the two men, hitting both of them. Police say the homeowner was shot in the leg. Investigators say two suspects were first taken to Southern Hills Hospital and then to UMC, where the homeowner was also taken. Henderson police are going after distracted drivers in a three week campaign. So if you're using your cell phone, eating or changing the radio station in your car and not paying attention, well, you could get slapped with a ticket. The Henderson Police Department received federal funding for extra patrols. The Stratosphere is officially rebranding to the Strat. Golden Entertainment bought the hotel and casino back in 2017. The company says renovations have already begun. New bars and restaurants will be added and the sports book will undergo a full remodel. I'm meteorologist Gina Cancellari and on this Groundhog Day, there was no shadow from Punxsutawney Phil, so that means that spring is coming early uh, and maybe so. We do have windy weather today and we have widespread rain in the forecast. Speaking of forecast, let's get you through 13 hours here. Calm conditions at 7 a.m. with some rain, then the wind picks up as we move into the afternoon. 58 degrees by 11 o'clock with rain continuing as we move into 4 o'clock with the wind sustained around 20 miles per hour. The rain continues as we move through the evening too. Also the wind that continues as well. Here's a look at your seven day planner. Windy weather for your Saturday drying out as we move into our Sunday. Then we have another weather making with oh, excuse me. Weather maker coming on Tuesday with wet weather and showers cooling down to just 50 degrees for Thursday. Jackie, you can always get the latest news at KTNV.com, our KTNV mobile app, our Roku channel and the latest version of Apple TV.